Hogan. Hogan is probably copywritten by Hulk Hogan himself, right? I'm pretty sure. Oh, did you need... No, I don't need a, th a thing, actually. We have some stuff that we could do with um, sorting out here. Um, Soul Stealer 5 million looks like it's going to be retired. You took me to the market. There were lots of pies and cakes. That's nice. That's really nice. Okay, it looks like Soul Stealer 5 million is going to be retired uh, in favor of this ebony bow that we picked up while we were down in Blackreach, which is pretty damn good. Um, we have a, our own amulet of Talos, which time between shouts is reduced by 20%. That's a great thing. Maybe I should just dis disenchant this and get this enchant so I can put it on anything. If I want to just do like no cooldown Fuzro does uh, until the end of time, that could be a good thing. I'm kind of tempted to actually wear this Dwemer purple um, cloak because I think it goes better with what I'm wearing. We have some glass armor here that we can enchant as well. This is light armor with 64 armor on it. Fuck, that's crazy. That is absolutely nuts. Cool. Okay, let's put some of this stuff in here. Let's disenchant this amulet to Talos because we, we've already made our shrine to Mr. T, right? So we don't need, we don't need another one. We got some food, we got some ingredients, we got a whole bunch of books that we can do with putting away. And it looks like we have a whole bunch of ores and stuff as well that we can do with putting away as well. Uh, we are going to enchant our ebony bow. We're gonna enchant our ebony bow, nice, with soul trap. And we're gonna go Okay, we're gonna enchant it with... We have three Grand Soul Gems. Do you think we should do this? Go for the Grand Soul Gem? Is it a little bit of a waste or should we just go for greater? It'll give us more charges, is that right? I mean, I feel like we might as well just go for Grand Soul Gem. But, but maybe not. Is Sip Spot dead? You'll get another one? Okay, I'll use a greater soul gem then. We have we have a lot of graders. Damage enchant and the biggest. Damage enchant. I don't think I have a damage enchant for the bow that I can use on an actual bow. I mean, I could do fire. Burns the targets for 14 points. Or frost damage, maybe? I feel like I need to have a way to, to actually... It's a fucking... Why can't I... Soul Trap. I, I need a way to... With a greater soul gem. Okay, good. Okay, let's rename this one. What the fuck? This is just not responding to any of my clicks right now. Okay, here we go. Let's call this one... Trappy. Nice. Okay, let's craft it. Do we want to enchant this Mourner's Hat? Oh yeah, we can enchant this too, right? Fortify Archery. Bows do 13% more damage. Sure. On our cloak at that. Fortify Archery. It doesn't tell me actually... Okay, let's try this. Let's, let's rename this one to... My Archery Cloak. <laughs> Crafted as well, yeah. Nice. People say Skyrim is one of the most dangerous places in Tamriel. Is that exactly what they say? You don't say. Okay. I don't know what the enchant is because of that of that text, but there we go. There we go. Anyway. Okay. So we want to um, favorite Trappy, and we want to assign Trappy to um, one, two. I think they're wrong. It's magnificent, and I'm proud Hey there, Sipsy boy. Trappy. Floating the air, so fancy free. Trappy. I like that. I like Trappy a lot. Okay, cool. So we got some extra damage now, too. Which is pretty good. Okay, let's store some potions here that we're not using. Um, basically, just all of these. I don't even know why I bother picking all these up, it's crazy. 
We never use them. Oh, not the skooma though. You never know when we're gonna need a bit of skooma out, out on the road, right? Ingredients. Let's store some ingredients as well. I think we want to get that Daedra heart. Fire salts. Okay, so hang on a second. Fire salts. We've got eight of them. Daedra heart. And what was the other one that we wanted? Nern. Crimson Nern root. Okay, perfect. Oh yeah, and Ice Wraith teeth as well. Hold up. Ice Wraith teeth. Perfect. Okay, so we just need two more fire salts. Good. We're getting there, boys. Sorry about this. We always have to do a little bit of this every time we come home. Because we pick up a lot of stuff while we're out, right? Um, girl's yellow dress. We could probably give that. Oh, we, we're back up to, like, just over six grand. That's pretty nice. Um, let's drop all this crap back off as well. Return to Maris. We will do that. We will return to Maris. Maurice Navidad. Oh, yeah, look at that. I want to. I want to set. I want to get some of this stuff. What is that? Is that like dragon bone armor? Looks fucking awesome. Imagine what Majol is gonna look like when she's wearing like one of those. Is that? Is that heavy? Yeah, that is heavy armor, right? It's saying like down there that heavy armor absorbs more damage, or is it considered light armor? I'm not sure. This I don't know. This I don't know. Um, okay, let's put all this stuff in. We got a whole bunch of ebony ore. Is that good? Moonstone ore. Or a calcum. We have a lot of or a calcum as well, which is pretty nice. Tunement sphere. Centurion dynamo core. I don't know what to do with these things, but let's hang on to them. They're kind of heavy too. Okay, we should be good. All right, hold up a second, actually. Oh yeah, look at my cloak. Look at my purple cloak. I look like some sort of vampire lord now. Oh, and you know what, Majol? Your cloak is looking fine as well. Fuck, this, clo this cloak mod is so good, isn't it? Holy shit. All right, let's go return this stuff to this guy. Um, because we've done it. We got the Elder Scroll as well, right? Let's go do that quick. his ass like right in my face nice not complaining like a big horse's ass right in my face in fact if anything is gonna be in my face let it be a horse's ass look at this is just a little small one hey what's up I'm back dig dwemer in the beyond I'll know your lost unknown and rise to your depths I've inscribed the lexicon give it quickly Whoa, say please. Extraordinary. I see it now. Manners. The ceiling structure interlocks in the tiniest fractals. Dwemer blood can loose the hooks, but none alive remain to bear it. A panoply of their brethren could gather to form a facsimile. A trick. Something they did not anticipate. No, not even them. Oh. The blood of Altmer, Bosmer, Dunmer, Falmer, and Orsimer. The elves still living provide the key. I'm not talking to elves. There you hence this extractor. It will drink the fresh blood of elves. Come when its set is complete. Harvest high elf blood and harvest wood elf blood. Why are you so eager to open this box? Ah, the box contains the heart. Ah, the essence of a god. No way. I have devoted my life to the Elder Scrolls, but their knowledge is a passing awareness Orc blood when as well. compared to the encompassing mind of divinity. The Dwemer were the last to touch it. It was thought to have been destroyed by the Nerevarine, 
But my lord told me otherwise. The Nerevarin. Who is your lord? The Daedric Prince of the Unknown. Of course. Emmaus Mora. I thought there were no secrets left to know until I first spoke to him. I knew there had to be a Daedric Prince behind all this. To work his will. A few murders, some dissent <laughs> spread, a plague or two. Sure. The secrets I can endure. Sure, of course. In time, he brought me here to the box. You caused two plagues? But he won't reveal how to open it. Maddening. <laughs> nice. Okay, well, we'll help you eventually. We'll eventually help you. Come on, Majol. Let's get out of here before the... There's a wretched abyss here. Come closer, bask in my presence. Why you got so many tentacles? I am Hermaeus Mora. I, I am the, the guardian of the unseen and knower of the unknown. I, I said yesterday I fell asleep you. while listening to your stream. And I had the trippiest damn dreams at one Most point I was a werewolf hunting a vampire, and trying to marry my stepmother then it devolved into some scooby doo BS investigation into a ghost. <laughs> oh, strangle throat. thanks so much. Sam and Onkrut, thanks so much as well, I appreciate it. What do you want of me, wretched abyss? Your continuing aid to Septimus renders him increasingly obsolete. He has served me well, but his time is nearing its end. He's not going to be too happy to hear that. Once that infernal lockbox is opened, he will have exhausted his usefulness to me. When that time comes, you shall take his place as my emissary. What say you? Uh, are you gonna try to kill me or give me like a good item or something? Sure, sure. Indeed. Speak with me when the box has been opened and all shall be revealed. Okay. Sure. Sure. Thanks. Thanks for letting me leave. Thanks. What the fuck was that? What in the actual fuck was that? So this this mad guy is gonna is gonna be killed soon. I think this guy is gonna is gonna off him. He's gonna be dead. He's gonna be dead meat. All right, we have to go back up to the throat of the world now with our Elder Scroll. We have to show this. I think we're gonna do some time travel here potentially. I'm not sure. He is going to. Um, do stuff to me with his tentacles? Maybe you're right about that. Maybe. You have it. The Kel, the Elder Scroll. Yes, I do. Tidkre, Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. I have it. It's right here. There is no question. You are doom driven. Kogan Akatosh. The very bones of the earth are at your disposal. Nice! How do I do this? Do I just have to use my Elder Scroll? The Elder Scroll. Where is it? There be dragons? No. Lost legends? No. Request for help? Elder Scro Scroll Dragon. Then fulfill your destiny. Take the scroll. Whoa! Oh, this is Today, so cool. Alduin's lordship will be restored. Rend him! But I honor your courage. Kreef Wolf Akrin. Die now in vain. Yell at him! 
Don't attack him with an axe? Who melee attacks a dragon for Christ's sake? Joel? Oh my god! Look at this! Take on! A glorious day, is it not? Holy shit! Have you no thought beyond the blooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? Gormley. Faldun does not rise to our challenge. I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Oh. Why does Aldun hang back? We've staked everything on his plan, Kills, old man. He will come. Feldir. Do not ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone. None have yet stood against Alduin himself. Oh, sword, Birka. They did not have Dragon Red. Once we bring him down, I promise. We have his Dragon Red. Understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why I brought the Elder Scroll. I sell him. We agreed not to use it. I never agree. If you are right, I no, will not need We will deal with Alduin ourselves. Here and now. We shall she see me soon enough. She looked right Alduin at me. Alduin approaches. So be it. Oh, this is so cool. I'm glad I don't have to do anything either. Me. Kalutis. Him hint palif. Su'u. Do it! Whoa! Nice! A temporary dragon. <laughs> nice! Whoa! Look at those moves! Joel, I hope you're watching this from somewhere. Are you even here? No, you're not. Fair enough. Oh my god. <laughs> I think she's dead. He's gonna die! Whoops! From all our endings to the last. Oh my god! You are banished! Fuck. Good job, guys. Did it. Yes. The world eater is gone. May the spirits have mercy on our soul. Fuck me, that is awesome. Shit. Okay, get ready, Majol. Okay, let's rend him. We're gonna do a dragon rend on him. Dragon rend. Oh my god. This is gonna be amazing. I know it now. He's coming in. He's swooping in. I'm gonna rend him. Yeah. 
Yes! Take that, baby! Here he comes. Is this the last boss, guys? Is this the end of the main quest? I got him again! It doesn't actually seem to do anything. It doesn't do much. Jesus. He's a tough bastard. Holy crap. Look at, look at all this damage he's tanking. I'll wait for him to come back down, guys. I'll rend him again. Come on, Majol, you gotta get in there and tank him. I can't do it alone. Woo! Got him! What does it actually do, though? Like, it doesn't do damage over time or anything. He's just a tough bastard. Does it force him to land? I got him again. Take him out. Maybe steel arrows isn't the way to go. Nailed him. Jesus. What? Whoa! I'm almost dead. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm I'm gonna keep doing it, guys. I'm gonna keep doing it. Plentiful healing. I've got tons of healing. What a goddamn mess. Peppering him. Keep up the peppering. Uh, Parthenax? <laughs> Sorry about that. You got in the line of fire, baby. I'm flanking him, guys. Don't worry. Joel, are you fighting the wrong drag? Why are you fighting Parthenax? Don't do it. Jeez. It's almost dead. I beat the game. I beat the whole game. I did it. Firstborn of Akatosh, Malagi Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you or anyone else. What the fuck? You cannot prevail against me. I will outlast you, mortal. Nice. Crazy. That was nuts. Holy shit, what a fight. Well, my mother was a strong woman. She's the one who infected me on my sword fight they took me. Where are you going? Can you imagine? Where the hell are you going? Look! Lock Modan! Lot Congra. You truly have the voice of a Dova. Nice. Alduin's allies will think twice after this victory. Yes, 
One of his allies could tell us Mat Mahus. Mat Mahus. It will not be so easy to convince one of them to betray him. Guys, listen. Can I use Dragon Rend on any dragon now? The palace in White Run, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. A fine place to trap one of Alduin's allies. Hmm? Sounds good to me, Parthernax. The Jarl of White Run might not think so, though. Hmm. Yes. But your Soom is strong. My Soom? I do not doubt that you can convince him of the need. Rend all the dragons, okay. Dragon's Reach was built to hold a dragon? Yes. Nice. This was ages ago, you understand. There were more of us then. Before the Bruniki, the Akaviri came and killed all my Zema. Killed all your Zema? I oh. used to visit him from time to time, nearly crazed by loneliness and captivity. Tiraz Sivaz. He did not even remember his own name. Fuck. I do not know how he came to be caught. But the Bronyun, the Jarl, was very proud of his pet, Pak. The Hothkasayun has been known as Dragon's Reach ever since. Okay. Uh, you're the master of the Greybeards. Do others come here to train? Mm. I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. Nice. But no, Dovahkiin. Others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, nice. you are the first in over a hundred years. I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. Uh, you meditate on the words? How? Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. All right, Majul, calm Contemplate down. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Okay. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus. Fime and Yol. Oh, I like Fus a lot, though. Fus. It is called force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Fus. Think of the way force may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. I'm just imagining every table in Skyrim that covered in vegetables. Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. Seriously? Force without effort added. I wish to meditate. You know what? I'm I'm good with Look that. Thum. Look Thum, Parthernax. Thanks so much. Oh. Push without force. Is that like a thing? Force without effort. You stagger 25% less and foes stagger 25% more. Okay, check it out. Foos! Yeah, I like that. Foos! <laughs> okay, so we have to go to Dragon's Reach. I think before we go to Dragon's Reach, though, let's... Holy shit, we have explored a lot of Skyrim this time around. Wow. Wow, wow, wee wow. Where's, uh... Where's Blackthorn? Where is it? And also, first lessons. No. Return to your roots. No. Harvest some orc blood. With friends like these. Oh yeah. Ill met by moonlight. The break of dawn. No stone unturned. Dawn guard. Dragonborn. 
Miscellaneous. Find the hidden village. No. What? So many, so many icons. I know. I know, I know, I know, right? Where, so where, where's, where do I go to start? Is there like a start to Blackthorn? Or is it just on here somewhere and I just don't know where it is? I didn't read too much about it. I mean, I installed the mod, but... It's apparently in the Reach somewhere. Which is over here, right? Skyhaven, Reach Red, Karth Spire, Red Eagle, Old Hroldan. Some Hag Rock Redoubt. I don't know what that is. Rorks, Dead, Lunt's Hut. Fort Sunguard, Bile Gulch Mine, Lost Valley Redoubt. Near Riften. Near Riften? It's a black town near Riften. Oh, of course, yeah, that's the, that's not the reach. This, there's Blackthorn. Okay, let's head over there. We'll go to Faldar's tooth first. Let's see what this is all about. Fuck, that was so awesome, man. That Dragon Ren thing was so cool. We went back in fucking time and watched some old Nords take down a dragon using an Elder Scroll. Jesus. That just felt so epic. I'm really glad that we did that. Oh my god. Majol, we got company here. I think we got some major company here. Fuck. I don't think we've cleared this place out yet. Alright, listen. Let's make a run for the run for the border. We'll put a custom marker so I know where we're going. Don't waste your time, Majol, on this trash. We'll come back. We'll come back and we'll 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 take this one by force. Today is not the day for that to happen. And we need some more arrows too. We're running though. No? Day 11? I know. It is. It's an epic one, Captain Uzo. We're playing the shit out of Skyrim. Feels good. Feels real good. Blackthorn. We installed a new mod as well, Captain Uzo, called Blackthorn. It's like a player housing village settlement sort of thing. I don't know how much it's gonna cost to get it all built up, but you can have everything. You can have like merchants and fucking. Um, like, different houses for citizens and shit like that. Looks pretty sweet. And apparently the house itself is really good too. There's lots of armor racks and stuff. Oops. Oh my god. I blame- I blame the knight. I blame the knight for that one. Oh shit. What a waste of arrows, dude. Okay, so this place should just be like a big hole in the ground. Oh, it is. Oh, look at this. Oh, I like this. It's just a shack. Who are these dudes? Dudes? Let's creep up to them a little. Oh, it's Vigilance of Stendar. Nice. Physicalities of werewolves. Kind of hard to steal from them, actually. Okay. Keep on moving then. Here we go. Here we go. This is it. Oh, look! The whole place is in a complete and utter state of disrepair. Blackthorn discovered. Nice. Hello? Hi, Grace. Need something? No? Until next time. No, I don't need anything actually, Grace. Thanks very much. I don't even think I need a deed for this place or anything. I think I just gotta find like a workbench. If I find a workbench, then I can just get going. I can get started on it. Where do you think the workbench is? Why is there a cultist here? Just a scratch! Haha! Keep telling yourself that, bitch. Oh. I have to search him first. Bothaya's Proving. What is this? He's got a black burlap cape as well. Okay, I've harvested some dark elf blood. What's this thing that I just got? Bathaya's proving. 
The following account is true, mate. Service Hello. warning to I'm those with I'm back with ears another joke for another stream. Here in hearts to know. What do you call a mage with a choking fetish? A necromancer. <laughs> Commander Millie, that's a real stinker. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. On a certain day, at a certain time, the faithful gathered to perform certain rituals, hoping to gain a glimpse of their master. The day was correct, the summoning true. Slashing a smoking tear through the veil, or tear through the veil, sh sorry, I should say. She, her very self, appeared before them, terrible and resplendent. She came, arrayed in ebony darker than a moonless night, wielding a blade burning hotter than the surface of the sun. And though she wore the guise of a Dunmer warrior queen, she towered above them like a statue carved from the Red Mountain itself. Why have you disturbed me? Surprised, the first among them prayed. Oh, Bothaya, prince of plots, deceiver of nations, queen of shadows, goddess of destruction, we come to worship thee. She looked down upon her followers, gathered to bear witness. Frowning, she asked the first, Tell me, you who profess to know me, how shall I know you? Afeard, he exclaimed, each night I pray to thee, each night I call out thy wondrous names. Surely thou must recognize the sound of my voice, thy most devoted of believers. She frowned and let out a long sigh, and then, and then of a sudden he was gone, the air from her lungs dispersing him. Turning to the second, she asked, And you, how shall I measure the worth of your existence? Stunned by the power of her voice, he bowed before her, darkening visage. She clapped her hands, and he too was gone. To the third, And you, tell me, how shall I know you apart from such... I feel like this is going to be like a joke or something. Like, you know, like the GD who grants three wishes. And you, tell me, how shall I know you apart from such as were they, of whom there is no trace? Shaken and speechless from the nullifications of his brethren, he whispered, have mercy upon us. She blinked twice. Once he was in agony. Twice he was destroyed. She cast a withering glance across those remaining and said, I do not grant mercy. And so it was with the others. She putting them to proof, they offering none. Finally, she came to me, eyes aglow with anger, tongue wet with hate, and said, Of all my believers, but two remain. Tell me, second to last, with what shall you prove your existence? Without hesitation, I drew forth my blade and buried it in the chest of the other who stood beside me, and without fear replied, Ask him whose blood now sprouts from my blade if I exist. She smiled, and the gates of oblivion opened between her teeth. Then she said, Tell me, now last of my followers, Wherefore do you remain where the others do not? I retrieved my blade and offered it up, saying, I am alive because that one is dead. I exist because I have the will to do so, and I shall remain as long as there are signs of my handwork, such as the blood dripping from this blade. Accepting my gift, she nodded and said, Indeed. That's a pretty cool story, actually. If in the reading your blood boils in your veins and your mind blazes with fire, then Bathia calls you. It is then most wise to heed her call. Find her on the mount which overlooks Windhelm. Meet us there and be tested. Oh, that's so fucking cool. Yeah, okay, sure. I'll go up there and be tested, for sure. That sounds fucking awesome. No? Anyone else? Bunch of weirdos? Todd Howard reads this to himself every night before bed? He probably does, actually. I bet you Todd Howard has killed, like, his fellow fellow senior designer, executive producers before as well, just to prove to a, a Daedric prince or queen or something that he demands. I'm sure that that has actually happened once or twice, right? In the Bethesda offices. Todd? You didn't kill another one, did you? I want to be the favorite. It's always Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Why? All right. I pretty much own this place, right? So I, I think I can... The Blackthorn Trader. Oh, I see. Maybe it's in here. Aha. Welcome. Welcome to Blackthorn. Well, Enter what's Blackthorn left of it? Manor, then cast the spell Bless Home that came with the mod. The Rapid Raccoon, thanks so much. Thanks so much. I think I'm just getting to that right now. The town of Blackthorn used to be a small farming town until a recent dragon attack left this village destroyed in the dragon's wake. Most of the town citizens either died while fighting the mighty beast or fled for their lives to nearby Riften, which left the town unoccupied. It wasn't until a recent death in the family that Grace and I obtained this land through inheritance from my father in law. And we decided to move here, clean the place up the best we could, and build a small shop to run together on the land he once owned, and was passed down on her side of the family. However, since Grace and I don't have funds to do much with the land, and the shop isn't drawing much business, we have decided to relinquish our ownership to someone that has the funds to build the town back to its full potential. 
and draw more traffic to this once great little farm town. If you have the gold, you can begin rebuilding Blackthorn at this workbench to unlock all the build options at the interior workbenches for each building. By rebuilding Blackthorn, you have the opportunity to collect income from all the various shops, nice, houses, and mine, along with the land to build your very own place to call home. Here's a list of supplies you'll need to furnish your new home and various other buildings. Firewood, silver ingots, steel ingots, iron ingots, corundum ingots, dwarven scrap metal, Gold ore, grand soul gems that are filled, got some. Amulet of Mara, RK, I've got all those. Linen wraps, been a bit lazy with those. Leather strips, dwarven oil, amulet of RK, amulet of Akatosh, saber cat pelt, saber cat tooth, large antlers, bear pelt, all, all this shit we have. We have tons of this stuff, right? Supplies can be ordered at the ledger on the store counter or bought from Winston and all other merchants. Fuck yeah. This is fucking awesome. Oh, and then I guess that's where our ordered supplies go. Activate order building supplies. Buying building supplies in bulk will give you a 20% discount. Ordered supplies are delivered to the Chester and the Blackthorn Trader Workbench. Oh my god, we can actually order everything that we need here. That is so awesome. Holy shit, look at all the stuff in here too. Fuck me. This is pretty cool! This seems really fucking- Whoa! <laughs> Winston? What's up? He's just having a- He's just having a little nap. He's just having a sleep. What's inside his wardrobe? Just some fine clothes. Oh. Hey Sips. Thanks to this old Hogan Skyrim adventure you have gotten my wife to enjoy watching your channel. We even installed Skyrim on her computer. Once again you prove to be the best guy. Weeks. Weeks! Thanks so much, man. That's uh, really kind of you. Thank you. And I hope your wife is enjoying playing um, Skyrim and stuff as well. Thanks, man. Thanks to you and your wife. Thank you so much. This place is pretty cool, actually. I like this. These are the Blackthorn Trader Profits, which are all ours. We can take them. Oh, my God. Okay, this is some good shit here. We need to take all this stuff. Oh, look at all the glass. And there's some straw here and stuff, too. Okay. Nice. I can't use this while I'm in co Who the fuck am I in combat with? Oh shit. Is somebody gonna come here and try to kill me now that I've stolen everything from the Blackthorn Trader? Hey, what's up? Oh, did you need something? Um, Take a look. What do you got? Oh my god. She's got some dwarven arrows. She's got some orcish arrows too. Yes, please. She's just got a bunch of junk, really. But she'll probably buy some junk from me, right? She's got a thousand gold on her. A thousand gold. Jesus. Holy shit, look at this circlet of major archery. Where the fuck did we get this from, guys? Bows do 25% more damage. That's nuts. That's better than Linway's hood. Whoa, shit. All right, we're back to using a circlet. Oh, now we look like a true king. <laughs> we look like a true king now. Hold up a second. Not in my blackthorn. Oh my god. So wait. What was the stagger thing from Foos? It doesn't mean that... It's not actually stronger though, right? It is not stronger. It doesn't feel any stronger anyway. Still can't like, oh my lord. Oh man, this is pretty cool so far. The only thing is though is that I'm not sure how I'm in combat in here. The game just crashed. <laughs> Oh my god, the game just hard crashed. <laughs> oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Well, I guess that's modding for you, isn't it? <laughs> oh fuck. That's hilarious. I'll be interesting to see where we where we pick up from. Maybe after we left. I don't know. The real Skyrim experience? 
Did I shout at the orb yet? No. We're in Blackthorn now. We're trying to get it to work. It, we, it looks like we've encountered our first bug with Blackthorn. Okay, we're in. Hi, Winston. You can't talk to Winston. Get him! Get me! I think Winston is super bugged. Hello? <laughs> I think he's super duper bugged. How do I, how do I, um, how do I get him like, never should have come here. Winston, why you gotta do me like this? Is it because I turned your sink on? No. He's just like aggroing me, right? Try waiting until morning. You have to check for conflicts. It could be load order related. Stop combat. Okay, let me try that. Stop combat. Okay, let's see if that worked. No. Nope. Yes? Ah! What do you got for sale? Take a look. Thanks, Winston. Get him! <laughs> <laughs> what a son of a bitch. What a son of a bitch. He's got a he's got a circlet of alchemy here. Some other stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, he's just like he's pissed again. Is it cause I stole all the stuff? Get him! <laughs> oh my god. You think it's cause Majol is fighting? Okay, hold on a second. Check this out. Let's do stop combat again. And then let's wait for like 24 hours. And see if it fixes it. Oh, you think it's because I'm in his house? I should be able to come in here, though, right? What do you th What do you think? Like, come in like during the the day instead of at night? Yeah, yeah. Need something? Oh, thanks very much. Thank you. Need something? It's during the day now. Divine smile on you, friend. Mm -hmm. Get him! <laughs> I think we're fine. Me? Hey! All right, here we go. A boat dock. Uh, we can hire a fence merchant, a Fletcher, a spell merchant. We can purchase the alchemy shop. I love the cold air. It's exhilarating. We can purchase chickens! A bookstore! Oh my god, guys! This is nuts! Look at all this stuff! The inn has been purchased. Oh no, we can't afford it, that's why. It's 10,000 bucks. There's a windmill, a well, town gates and walls, a spell market stall, path lanterns. Ooh, path lanterns. Yeah. Okay, we bought some pack lanterns apparently. My father wanted me we to bought some patio lanterns. As a Let's see what but that I set looks my like. A bit higher. He never complained. Windmill, a well, we can purchase a well for 750 bucks. Guard barracks, follower barracks, a hole, a farmhouse, the citizen house. Is that my house? Or is that just for the citizens to live in? Ah, oh, no, Blackthorn Manor, this must be mine. 5,000 bucks. There's a guest house available for it as well. And there's the mine too. 5,500 bucks, but we can make an income from this as well, right? No? I still have plenty of shit to sell back at home. It's true, yeah. I'm super skinned. Yeah, I know, I had like 30 grand, but I um, I spent it all on uh, archery training. Um, spell market, town gates and walls. 1,500 bucks. Let's see what some of this stuff looks like. Two hours have passed. 
Is that so? Okay, let's see what it looks like out here now. We should have some lanterns and some gates and walls. What can I do for you? Oh shit, yeah, we do. Whoa! Ah, oh, fuck! Ah, oh, fuck, this looks so good! Guys, I could really fucking enjoy this. I feel like I could really enjoy the shit out of this one. Except for this fucking guy who's... I've seen here. enough death to last three lifetimes. Get out. I never tired of a good fight. What's this? What do you make of that? It's a fucking bird's nest right in the middle of... Oh my god. Hold up a second here, Majol. Check this out. Billy Majol. Oh my god. A double tap. There's a boat dock available as well. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god, we could spend a lot of time and money here for sure, right? Look at all this good shit. Look at this. So once we start building up some of the houses, this whole place will start to come to life, right? Be full of people that we can talk to and we can like make new acquaintances and we can chuck this fox like over there as well. Get out of here. Whoa, what a toss. Holy shit. I feel like my guy is stronger all of a sudden after doing all those main quest lines. I have a much stronger guy now. What do you guys think? No? Possibly? Come to life. You think so? Okay, let's wait for like seven hours so that it's like daytime again. He seems to be sleeping. Bang, 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 bang. Okay, we gotta go sell some stuff and make some money if we wanna get, like, the house going. I think I've that... seen enough death to last three lifetimes. I think the house itself is meant to be quite good. Lots of spaces to put, like, armor racks and stuff like that. Armor mannequins and whatnot, so we can set up all the cool stuff that we're getting. Oh man, coming back to Lakeview Manor is gonna be a real downer now. Now that we have our own town, basically. Is there a mod list for this? Yeah, there is. Um, I think it's like, I think there's a command, it's like mod list or something like that. Close the gates? No, no, we're gonna get some guards. We'll let them handle all the gates and stuff. How do we move people over there too? I wonder if we can get our wife to go over there. Actually, do we want our wife to go over there? Maybe we leave our wife and our kids like in this house. And then just slowly migrate into our new bachelor pad. <laughs> Fucking Camilla. The only thing is though is that Camilla does, um, whoa. Papa, you're back. Yeah, that's me. Did you get me a present? Of course I did. Wow, really? What do you get me? You should have seen me in the height of my A new place. yellow dress. I was fearless and took Thanks. too many risks. <laughs> but that's wow. what it was all about. Holy shit, that was great. Nice. All right. We have we do have things to sell for some big money. Um so let's start doing that. Let's start selling. Let's hang on to these amulets cuz I think we kind of need them. Um, but like this, uh, robe of alteration. Magicka regenerates 100% faster. That's kind of nuts, actually. Uh, let's sell that. Um, we've got two belted tunics and black mage robes. Some blue robes for some reason. Got the blades helmet we want to hang on to. Circlet of illusion. Circlet of minor archery we'll hang on to. Cloaks we'll always hang on to as well. There's this dwarven shield of dwindling fire. Fuck it, let's just sell this thing. Ebony armor and boots, I think we'll hang on to. Elven armor of illusion, we'll sell. Elven gauntlets of major log picking, let's keep. Elven shield, what else do we have here? We got some fur boots and stuff. General Tullius's armor, we'll hang on to. Let's hang on to this glass armor too. Lock picking, extreme wielding. They seem like pretty good actually. Okay, we can sell a lot of these old circlets and stuff because we don't really need them. Hooded Thalmor robes. We're not even going to get that much money for these, I don't think. Linways. There's a merchant's hat here. There's my nutsack. And my nuttier nutsack as well. I think we can sell both of these, actually. We don't need them. Uh, major alchemy, major haggling, minor deft hands, ma minor stamina can go. Wielding, let's keep for a disenchant. This can go. Uh, Nordic carved armor is a pretty good one. Uh, we can sell these. Orcus shield. I'm sure we'll find another one, but let's just hang on to it. We got some party clothes and shoes. 
They seem kind of rare. Let's hang on to them. Scaled armor. Scaled armor of imminent alteration. Scaled boots of imminent sneaking. They, they were really good, actually. Okay, let's take that as well. All these rings. Actually, we want to hang on to a couple of them. But just not all of them. These silver necklaces can go. These can go. Uh, steel plate gauntlets can go as well. Storm cloak stuff will set up. That can go. Our wedding ring that we don't even wear. <laughs> ah, God. Okay. Some of the stuff I wanted to disenchant, but I don't need to. Like this can go. Played a Falkreath. I thought we, I thought we actually set this up somewhere, but maybe we didn't. Dwarven sword of devouring. Ebony Greatsword. Elven Bow of Dread can go. Two Elven Swords that we don't need as well. But we're going to be over overweight now. 13. 13 is going to put us one over. So we want something like this Forsworn Bow. Perfect. Okay. Let's go sell a bunch of this crap at various merchants across Skyrim. Shall we? Am I still married to Camilla? You know I am. You know I am. Okay, first stop, Falkreath. Where else am I able to build player housing that's not like Blackthorn, though? There's there's other places, right? I, I'm thinking one is, is possibly in Dawnstar, maybe? And then the other one, I don't know. Like, I've only ever made Lakeview Manor, so I don't know. Where are you guys going? Grave Pine Goods, we're gonna have to wait. Oh my god, we're gonna have to wait, like, 13 hours for this to open again. Dawnstar and Warthal. Oh yeah, get the money from Camilla. Yeah, we'll we'll make a couple of runs, so we'll go back and get it. Don't worry. Done. Is he open? Not quite. I've seen enough death to last three lifetimes. Okay, he's open. Got something for just about everybody in here. I got Give something for you. Well met. Unlike my brother, I have no dislike of strength. Take a look. He's only got 758 bucks, the asshole. Um, okay. Let's sell this. 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 132 bucks. Oh my god, some of this stuff is worth a fucking fortune. Holy crap. Forceworn bow. Um, and then we had a whole bunch of like... Not those. God damn the holy shit. Belted tunic can go. That can go. Circlet of illusion. Some of this stuff is worth a fucking fortune though. Holy shit. 51 gold. Yeah, that's fine. Steal anything from my shop and you'll break. We should get that mod that makes the merchants like rich, right? It's not really cheating, is it? Riverwood next? We'll go to what's his faces, Camilla's brother's place. The fence, the ragged flag, it has quite a bit of money. Well, we have to go down there anyway to check the tribute chest, I guess. So we could go down there after this. I love how we've been playing this game so long. We kind of know where like all the stuff is now. Like we, there's like definitely a circuit we could do to sell like all the stuff. It's quite nice, isn't it? You and me. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Just get on with it. Jesus. Okay, Elven Bow Dread, 442 bucks. 370. 370, 362. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, we're back up to six grand. So we can actually right, build the manor now, I think. Should we try building it? See what it opens up? It might just build it straight up, though, right? It might just... It might actually just build it straight up with, with it all furnished and stuff. Do you think we're going to need, like, all the extras? Do you think it'll be like uh, like Lakeview Manor, where we had to, like, individually, like, get Uthgird to, like, build stuff or whatever? Put the circlet back on. Did I take it off? I don't think I took it off, did I? Oh, fuck, I did. Oh, of course. I, um... The game crashed. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. Good. 
I think the only thing is, though, is that we can only use this trader, like, during the day. Otherwise, he aggroes, right? And the game can crash. 